January 6th, that's the day you're invited to see the beautiful new Ford for 1954. And this year, the Worth More car declares a dividend in style, a dividend in power, a dividend in comfort, plus optional new power assists. See Ford for 1954 at your Ford dealers January 6th. This is the new $11 million Ford Styling Center at Dearborn, Michigan, where the first 1954 Ford was developed and approved. Here in a beautiful garden designed to present the car in a natural outdoor setting, Ford stylists and engineers studied model after model of the 54 Ford before determining the final design. Each feature, from headlight to taillight, had to be a perfect blend of function and beauty. It all began here on the drawing boards in Ford's advanced styling studio. From many thousands of sketches, the choice was narrowed to a select few. And still later, after an exhaustive study by Ford's top designers, the best of these features were incorporated into scale drawing. Meanwhile, other stylists were examining and testing thousands of fabrics, patterns, and colors for the interiors of the 54 Ford. Here are only a few of the 23 quality upholstery materials finally selected for their colorful beauty and durability and offered in the 1954 Ford. Just as important as these individual details is the manner in which Ford stylists have integrated them into a distinctive unified whole. No matter which of Ford's 14 different body styles you choose, your 54 Ford will always be in style because it has been styled for the future. See the beautiful new 1954 Ford at your Ford dealers. I'm Bob Maxwell. Twenty-two years ago, Ford introduced the V8 engine to the low-price field. This year, Ford leads again with the all-new Y-Block V8. And here to take us from 1932 to 1954 is Mr. V.G. Raviola, executive engine engineer of the Ford Motor Company engineering staff. This V8 was the most modern engine of its day, and our brand-new V8 is again setting the pace. Size and weight are about the same, yet we've engineered 50% more torque and double the horsepower into the new Ford V8. Low friction design is the key. By shortening the piston stroke, we've reduced the energy loss to friction by as much as 30%. This is now performance power. And to get more go from every drop of gasoline, we've designed this new turbo wedge combustion chamber. Now, when the piston reaches the top, the gas is forced out of the squish area at jet velocity for more complete, more efficient burning. Ford's advanced design gives you a bonus in power, performance, and economy. And Ford's new iBlock 6 features this same advanced low friction design and turbo wedge combustion chamber. Both Ford engines are go-getters, both gas savers. Test drive both when you test drive the 54 Ford. I'm Bob Maxwell, and here with the reasons behind Ford's new deep block engine design is Mr. Ken Vogt of the Ford Motor Company engineering staff. Well, first let me show you what we mean by deep block design. Notice how the six-cylinder engine block is extended far down below the center line of the crankshaft so that it takes on the structural shape of an I-beam, and that makes the block a much stronger unit. Same is true with our new Y-block V8 engine. Most V8 blocks end about right here. But again, by good designing, we have a structural Y-shaped deep block that really provides rigidity. The purpose of this advanced deep block design is to provide far more rigid alignment for the crankshaft, which in turn means smoother engine performance, longer engine life. Test drive one or both of these engines, the all-new Y-Block V8 or the new I-Block 6. You'll find they're the smoothest engines in Ford's field. A man's work is from sun to sun, but a woman's work, well, that practically stops the second she slides behind the wheel of a Ford. With a touch and a button, she can raise or lower the seat or move it forward or backward automatically. She presses another button to raise or lower the windows. Now she moves the Ford automatic lever to drive and enjoys automatic shifting no matter how many stops and starts she has to make. And speaking of stops, all it takes is a gentle touch on the pedal with Ford's new Swift Sure Power Brakes to stop smoothly and quickly. Now watch how easy parking is with Ford's Master Guide Power Steering. 
She's merely guiding the car. Master Guide is doing the work. These five driver assists, all available in the 54 Ford, are only part of the story. In any 54 Ford, you enjoy many new features that give you added driving ease. You get new ball joint front suspension, exclusive in Ford Field, that takes you around corners like a breeze, gives you better rotability and an even smoother ride. Plus, the greatest power advances since the original Ford V8. Ford's new 130 horsepower wide block V8 or 115 horsepower mileage maker 6. Both high compression, low friction engines that give you new responsiveness in performance and real economy of operation. Test drive the car that's engineered to take the work out of driving. The great new 1954 Ford. Hello, I'm Bob Denton, and I'm sitting in what we call a cutaway model Ford. It's been cut away to dramatize the inside story of Ford's sturdy 1954 Crestmark body. The new Astrodial instrument panel, the trim and the upholstery are all color keyed to Ford's beautiful new exterior colors. Under these fabrics, you'll find a contoured layer of foam rubber cushioning on Ford Custom Line and Crestline models. And all Fords feature non-sag springs for comfort and control support. Between you and the outer shell of a 1954 Ford, you'll find sound and weather insulation like this thick asphalt and heavy glass fiber, giving you a more quiet, more comfortable ride. Back in Ford's luggage compartment, the shorter gas filler pipe and space-saving hinges add at least one more suitcase to your vacation equipment. Your Ford dealer cordially invites you to drop in to test drive the great new 1954 Ford. I'm Bob Maxwell, and here with news about the beautiful new 54 Ford interiors is Mr. Ted Hobbs, Ford Car Fabric Specialist. This seat is from a Ford Skyliner with a two-tone exterior of Cameo Carl and Sandstone White. The upholstery is a striking combination of Carl and black nylon with a white vinyl bolster, and it harmonizes perfectly with the Skyliner's handsome exterior. In fact, all our fabrics are designed to harmonize with specific body and trim color combinations. Here's something interesting. We've combined man-made fibers with natural fibers to get upholstery like this new woven plastic interlaced with metallic yarns. We use woven plastics to dress the interiors of all four Ford station wagons. Ford for 54 offers hundreds of color, upholstery, and body style combinations. See them and take a test drive of the 54 Ford at your Ford dealers. Discover now the convenience of owning two Fords. When Dad goes off on a long business trip, you and the children are not pinned down when you're a two Ford family. Test drive another 1954 Ford, the standard for the American road. Guess where he's from? Right, Texas. Now guess where she's from? Well, I'm from Texas too. My name is Pamela Dowdy, and I'm the fashion show director here at Neiman Marcus in Dallas. You know, Texas women are extremely fashion conscious in their homes, their clothes, and their automobiles. That's why so many of our patrons drive to Neiman Marcus in beautiful new 1954 Fords. The decorator-styled fabrics and trim are fashioned to suit the most exacting tastes. That's why we like the new 54 Ford. We Texas men like Fords for lots of other reasons, too. One thing we especially like is this Y8 brand right here. It stands for Ford's new Y-block V8 engine. Just one more reason why you'll see more and more smart Texans driving Fords nowadays. Yes, Ford's a standard for Texas roads, and that means the American road, too. Now, for 1954, you can have the exact car you want in Ford. Choose from three great lines, 14 brilliant body styles, including one, the brand new Ford Skyliner. A tinted transparent top gives you a head in the clouds feel with closed car comfort. Two, the new Crestline four door with more fine car features than have ever been offered before in the low price field. Three, you'll really go for the third newcomer to the Ford line, this custom line ranch wagon, also available in the main line series and only one of four Ford station wagons in 1954. This beautiful Ford Sunliner is the top downer's delight, while this Ford Victoria is typical of Ford's trend-setting styling. 
A variety of handsome single-tone and two-tone color combinations and smartly fashioned upholstery and interior trim satisfy the most demanding taste. Choose one of two great Ford engines, the 130-horsepower Y-Block V8 or the 115-horsepower I-Block Mileage Maker 6. Both are overhead valve, high compression, low friction engines. Smoother, livelier, more responsive, and so economical to operate. Every Ford for 54 gives you new riding comfort and handling ease with the new ball joint front suspension, exclusive with Ford in its field. For the car for you, see the great new line of 54 Fords at your Ford dealer soon. Ford's got the big gun. It's Ford's new 130 horsepower V8, the most powerful engine in any low-priced car, the only V8 in Ford's field. See your Ford dealer and test drive a new Ford V8. It costs less to buy than most sixes, and your Ford dealer is now trading high. You know, some people used to think you could get a comfortable ride only with a big, heavy car like this one. Today, however, the new Ford is proving is how you use weight how you spring it that counts. Notice how the body of this Ford stays level while the front and rear wheels absorb the bumps. The secret? Well, it's really a combination of many advanced ride features all working together. Now, for example, Ford has increased the vertical travel of the front wheels, so the wheels can absorb bigger bumps while transmitting less road shock to the body. And other features that help reduce road shock are these new type front end compression bumpers that act as buffers between wheels and frame. And these hydrocoil springs, which are individually tailored to the weight of each Ford model. And these are Ford's variable rate rear suspension springs that automatically adjust their action to suit varying road and load conditions. Notice too how these rear shock absorbers are mounted diagonally to help eliminate side sway. Now, you've seen only a few of Ford's many ride features, but more important than any single one is the way Ford engineers have been able to balance them all so that they work together. And that's why a Ford rides softer by far than many cars weighing hundreds of pounds more. Here's a typical suburban scene. She needs the car for shopping, and he needs the car for work. What's the solution? Got the Ford in half? Well, hardly. Here's the answer, two Fords. Today, one out of every 10 families needs two cars, and 400,000 families own two Fords. Here's why. For us, having two cars is a necessity. And after checking the figures, we found the new Ford is so economical to buy and operate that we can own two of them for just a little more than the cost of any one of several expensive makes. And believe me, the convenience is worth it. I agree. My husband has the two-door for business. I have the ranch wagon for errands or visiting or taking the kids to the beach. Johnny, our oldest boy, gets it for dates. And when we have any heavy hauling to do, that rear seat falls away in a jiffy. Yes, we're a happy family now that we're a two-Ford family. Folks, the car you own today may well provide the down payment on two new Fords. If your family likes the two-car idea, drop in and talk it over with your Ford dealer. Maybe there are two Fords in your future. I'm a Ford dealer, and like all Ford dealers, I'm doing a land office business. And this new 54 Ford with its clean, modern styling is one reason why. And Ford's the only car in its field that offers a choice of V8 or 6. Test drive a new Ford at your Ford dealers today. Finest, most versatile automatic transmission ever built. Fordomatic. And here to tell you exactly why is Fordomatic transmission engineer Mr. Bert Erickson of the Ford Motor Company engineering staff. The first reason for Fordomatic's great versatility is our fluid torque converter. This unit provides the ultimate in smooth power flow and responds instantly to changing demands for acceleration. Another reason is Fordomatic's special gear system. It's the only automatic drive in Ford's field that offers an automatic intermediate gear. 
It's this intermediate gear that accelerates you rapidly from a standing start to high gear without excessive engine speed. And in case you need an extra burst of speed, say for passing, intermediate gear is again available up to speeds of 60 miles an hour by simply pressing the accelerator to the floor. Now another advantage. When you use Fortomatic's low range for downhill braking, it's this intermediate gear that comes in first at highway speeds. Then when you slow to 25 miles an hour, Fortomatic's low gear engages automatically for maximum braking. Fortomatic is the most versatile. And it's available on all 28 Ford models with either of Ford's engines. Test drive the 54 Ford with Fortomatic. That's the fifth Ford I've sold today. We're doing a land office business. Let me show you why. Look at this beautiful 54 Ford. There's the styling that has set the trend in the whole industry. And Ford styling is a mighty good protection for your investment. This car will look just as good to a used car buyer next year as it does to you today. And another point. Other cars in Ford's field don't have a V8 engine, but we do. And you can have it in all new body styles. Come and test drive a new 130 horsepower Ford V8. Bring your old car in too. You'd be surprised how much your Ford dealer will give you in trade on a new Ford. Oh, excuse me, that must be another customer. Maybe it's you. We'd like you to meet Mr. Vincent Conroy, a man who was so impressed with the 1953 Ford that he ordered from Ford dealers throughout the country not one, not two, but 1,239 Fords. He's a vice president of Avis Rent-A-Car System, the largest airport car rental service in the world. Why Ford, Mr. Conroy? Well, the Avis Rent-A-Car System has to satisfy over 800,000 customers and at the same time make a healthy profit. We have found that Ford does both jobs and does them well. Ford's low initial cost is mighty attractive, whether you buy one car or 1,200. Avis pays for the gas and oil. That's why we like Ford's low running cost. You heard how a Ford 6 with overdrive won the sweepstakes award in the 1953 mobile gas economy run. Ford beat all other cars in economy, regardless of size or weight. With low costs of servicing and genuine Ford parts always available, we save because we have more cars in better shape more of the time. This year we bought 1,239 new Fords. When we order the 1954 models, we'll have to sell 1,239 Fords. And as any used car dealer will tell you, Ford's depreciation is the lowest of any car in its field. Yes, Avis has learned just as you too will learn. Ford is worth more when you buy it and is worth more when you sell it. Good evening. The ball and socket joint is one of the most flexible joint systems known to man and a very important part of your skeletal system. The joint in your shoulder and in your hip are two fine examples of such a free moving joint. Ford has put the ball and socket joint to work in the front end suspension of its new 1954 cars. But first, let's take a look at the conventional front end suspension system. A spindle arm, a kingpin, and the spindle itself are all connected by metal-to-metal -metal connections requiring lubrication at 16 points. Now look at Ford's new suspension, a single husky forging with ball and sockets at each end, sealed to keep out dust and corrosion. These points are suspended on rubber bushings and need no lubrication. In the whole system, there are only four lubrication points. Ford's new ball joint suspension system, exclusive to Ford in its field, is an integral part of the all-new 1954 Ford chassis. It permits greater wheel travel so that the front wheels of the new 54 Ford step right over the bumps. This means a smoother, more level ride with lasting new car handling ease. Actually, you have to test drive the new 1954 Ford to be convinced. Do it tomorrow at your Ford dealer's. 
Why let money go down the drain on a medium-priced car? This one, with heater, radio, and automatic drive, carries a suggested price of $386 more than a Ford equipped the same way. Pocket your dividend. Buy a new Ford at your Ford dealers. I'm Bob Maxwell. Sometimes automotive engineers can simplify a part of a car and accomplish extraordinary results. Here with a concrete example is Mr. Bill Burnett, chief Ford car engineer of the Ford Motor Company engineering staff. Our new ball joint front wheel suspension is simplicity itself. Let me show you what I mean. Here you see the various parts that go to make up the conventional kingpin type of suspension, and over here the advanced new ball joint suspension. In most kingpin systems, there are eight major moving parts, but in Ford's ball joint type, there are only three. Simplification makes it a better suspension unit, and here's why. In the kingpin system, the front wheel spindle swings on a complicated kingpin hinging here for steering, and two additional pivot points here and here are needed to handle the up and down movement of the wheels over bumps. In the ball joint suspension, there is only this single husky spindle forging mounted at each end in these ball and socket joints. This way, one spindle unit takes care of both steering and up and down springing of the wheels. Our new suspension is a perfect example of modern, simplified design. No other car in Ford's field offers you this modern ball joint suspension. It makes a tremendous improvement in steering ease and riding comfort. A difference you'll notice right away when you test drive the 1954 Ford. The construction of a modern skyscraper is a miracle of engineering, yet it would never get off the ground without the famous I-beam, a steel girder designed for greater strength and rigidity. The I-design in Ford's new 115 horsepower I-Block 6 engine also means greater strength and rigidity. Because it adds more support to the crankshaft, you get smoother, quieter performance and longer engine life. Ford's iBlock 6 is now available in every one of Ford's handsome new 1954 body styles, 14 in all. Whether you choose the beautiful Ford Sunliner, America's most popular convertible, the distinguished new Crestline four-door sedan, or the mainline two-door sedan, every 1954 Ford can be yours with either the new iBlock 6 or the new 130 horsepower Y-Block V8 engine. Test drive these cars with the most modern engines in the industry, the 1954 Fords. I'm Bob Maxwell, and this is a live air hose, which will be used to show you how Ford's brakes are designed with your safety in mind. And here to demonstrate this safety feature is Mr. Ed Kaiser, Ford brake engineer of the Ford Motor Company engineering staff. As you probably know, this is brake lining. If sloppy road conditions soak this lining, you may lose nearly all your braking power and find your car out of control. Now let's see what'll happen if a stream of road splash hits Ford's brakes. Bob, if you will spin the wheel, we'll simulate a road condition. Notice the water is drenching the opening where the revolving brake drum meets the backing plate. Now, Bob, if you'll pull the wheel, we'll see the brake lining is perfectly dry. We've designed Ford's brakes to keep weather and dirt out. Ford is the only car in its field that has this lip and groove double seal. A seal up here and a seal down here. And when the wheel turns, the centrifugal force of the revolving brake drum works with the double seal to throw off any water that might splash up. As you just saw, safety is one of the many high standards Ford has set. Go to your Ford dealers. Test drive the beautiful 1954 Ford. You'll see that in every way, the 54 Ford is the standard for the American road. I'm Bob Maxwell. Generally, we think of automotive engineers as men who design something into an engine. But here's Mr. Paul Clayton from the Ford Motor Company engineering staff, who's made it a career to design something out of an engine. It's good riddance, too. We've been eliminating the biggest power waster of all from Ford's engines, internal friction. Now the greatest source of friction is the moving piston that rubs constantly against the cylinder wall. Well naturally, the longer the piston stroke, the more rubbing or friction there is. So we've designed an engine with a shorter stroke. 
The result is that we have reduced the power lost to friction by a full 40%. Let me show you how engine life is increased. When one of our older V8 cars has traveled 85,000 miles, the piston has traveled 30,000 miles inside its cylinder. For this same piston travel, which means the same wear, the 1954 Ford with Y-block V8 engine will travel over 100,000 miles. Short stroke means longer engine life, greater efficiency, and economy. Thank you, Mr. Clayton. This low friction design is exclusive to Ford in its field. Whichever engine you choose, the all-new 130 horsepower Y-block V8 or the new 115 horsepower I-block 6, low friction design will pay dividends in finer performance, better economy, and longer engine life. The big difference between Ford and the medium-priced cars is price itself. For example, here is a medium-priced eight-cylinder car with a heater, radio, and automatic transmission. Its suggested list price is $386 more than a new 54 Ford equipped the same way. Ford gives you everything it has and for a lot less. Why not buy a new Ford? With your $386 dividend, you could also have power steering, power brakes, power lift windows, a four-way power adjustable seat, and directional signals, and you'll have money left over. So come on into your Ford dealers and take your pick. Ford offers you your choice of V8 or six engine in any model. You don't have to pay more than the price of a Ford for a truly fine car. See your Ford dealer today. Test drive America's style leader, the beautiful 1954 Ford. Test drive the car that leads its field in power. Ford offers 130 horsepower, high compression V8 performance, the only V8 in Ford's field. For the best buy on your new car, talk trade with your Ford dealer. This year, Ford, the worth more car, declares a dividend. A dividend that makes it worth even more for 54. You get a dividend in styling with Ford's clean, handsome lines and new interior luxury. A dividend in performance with either of Ford's two new engines, the 130 horsepower Y-Block V8 or the 115 horsepower Mileage Maker 6. A dividend in economy with longer engine life and more miles per gallon of gas. Notice the new Astrodial control panel that makes instruments easier to read. Just one of Ford's many safety dividends. In the 54 Ford, you also get a dividend in rotability that comes from the new ball joint front suspension, exclusive to Ford in its field, with new stability on turns and new riding comfort on any road. Add to these the extra dividends Ford offers as worthwhile optional additions. ford matic Drive, Master Guide Power Steering, Swift Sure Power Brakes, Power Lift Windows, and Four-Way Power Seats. Then you'll know why, more than ever, Ford for 1954 is the standard for the American road.